Welcome back to Terramator Gardens. Today we're going to be talking about orange ram's horn snails. And I do want to apologize for the lighting. The My camera is not doing these snails justice right now. But they should be a lot oranger than they appear. But let's get into it. The orange ram's horn snail is not only a popular aquarium inhabitant due to its striking color, but also serves as an excellent algae cleaner helping to maintain the tank's ecosystem. The ram's horn snail is found in freshwater habitats worldwide. The orange variant has been selectively bred for its vibrant color, making it a favorite among Aquarius. It has a distinct coiled shell that resembles a ram's horn. Its bright orange color makes it stand out in any aquarium setting. The snails typically grow to about one inch in diameter. These snails thrive in freshwater aquariums with temperatures ranging from 70 to 78 degrees Fahrenheit and a pH between seven and eight. They prefer tanks with plenty of vegetation and surfaces to graze on. Regular water changes and a clean environment are crucial for their well-being. Orange ram's horn snails are compatible with a wide range of aquarium plants such as java ferns and hornworts. They coexist well with non-aggressive fish species, shrimp, and other snails contributing to a balanced ecosystem. These snails are known for their continuous grazing behavior, um, consuming algae, and they reproduce rapidly under optimal conditions laying egg clusters on submerged surfaces all over the tank. While they are beneficial for algae control, their population does need to be monitored to prevent overpopulation. Orange ram's horn snails are primarily used in aquariums for their aesthetic appeal and their utility in keeping algae levels in check. They are known, they, they are, there are, there are no, no medicinal uses for these snails. I should cut that out, but I'm not. The orange ram's horn snail is a valuable addition to any freshwater aquarium, providing both beauty and functionality. Its unique appearance and beneficial cleaning habits make it a favorite among hobbyists. And that wraps up our aquatic species profile for this evening. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more profiles. We drop them every day. Thanks for tuning in.